<clears throat> oh god. Hello. And yeah, there was a long time since I last played. Um, oh wait, 16 it is. Oh, 10 days ago since I last played. So I thought it was two weeks, but no, it was 10 days. Alright. Um, uh, let's talk to this guy first. Gabriel? Yes, ma'am. What is happening here? What do you know about Leonard Dahl? Nothing really. I never got to talk to him much. Do you know who Katarina Berg is? She may also go by the name Melinda. I don't know about Katarina, but Melinda? That's the name of the school teacher, I think. At least that's what I heard the kids call her outside. Are you absolutely sure? Positive. As far as I know, she's the only Melinda in Nordsund. That's excellent news. If you see her, take her into custody immediately. And let your colleagues know to be on the lookout, too. Yes, ma'am. Oh, okay. Is that a school teacher? What do you know about Mel- Not a- Alright. I mean, we just- Let's ask about Leonard's accident. What can you tell me about this accident? <clears throat> Nothing that isn't second-hand information. You should talk directly to the witness. Uh, let's see. I don't need to make him forget anything. <laughs> okay. Uh, let's see. What do you know about the conduit? It's some fringe religious- Yeah. Right. Sort of, but- Understood. Okay. Okay, that's all for now. Roger that, ma'am. And then, let's see. Instructions. This says the machine works by grinding down organics into smaller chunks, and then burning them to create biogas. The control panel here can be used to retract the grinding gears and access the chamber, but the system waits for the latest batch to be incinerated first. Okay. Something to remember. Let's see, power cables. These must provide power for the machine. Not sure which cable leads to what. I shouldn't mess around. I mean, it looks like it has been destroyed. A control panel. All right, well, let's look. Forensic scanner. Maybe I'm in the way, wait. Okay, nothing actually. I shouldn't mess around. About half filled with God knows what. A probably a plant matter. Sizes. Maybe for transporting some of the recycled Would be my guess. Just a sort of it. A plant matter. Well, let's talk to the worker. Oh, wait. Thank God you're here. Slow down, relax. You're safe. We're here to help. Start at the beginning. <sighs> okay. Oh, when fuck. I figured he was still out late with some of the guys and that the machines had sprung to life on their own somehow. I went back to bed and slept through the night. Didn't hear anything else. When I came back this morning to work just half an hour ago, Leonard was still gone. He's usually up and about way before my shift starts. I did huh. a routine check of the organics processor and and that's when I noticed his remains in there. The victim is inside that machine? Yes. Could it have been an accident? I don't know. God, I, I can't get it out of my head. Please try to calm down. Could it have been an accident? It could. Uh... Maybe he <coughs> fell down in the pipe uh, and uh, and uh, was torn to shreds. Oh God, poor Leonard! All right. Oh man. So I guess I have to press the biometric one. Oh, come on. Before I That's talk. No use. He's having a panic attack. All right.
Let's see. Shredded human male remains, age indeterminable. Postmortem. This clearly wasn't an accident then. It was a disposal of a murder victim. Ah, oh, all right. Not an accident. Murder. I should try to get access to the remains. all so let's talk to gabriel and tell him this is not an accident it's gabriel? a fucking murder yes ma'am so it looks like leonard's accident was a murder after all seems so yeah we have to catch this psycho before he strikes again agreed do you know how this big machine works no idea but there's some kind of label on it near the switches maybe that can help ah i'll have a look Hmm, okay. Okay, that's all for now. Roger that, man. Um, it's the instructions, right? This says the machine works by grinding down organics. The control panel here can be used to retract the grinding gears and access the chamber. But this. All right. Uh, can I talk to him? This now? conveyor belt sent. Let's go in here and check. Mostly to see. history books and. This is probably where Leonard handled. Can we look for Leonard's DNA? Now when we have something. So it looks like it, or if I have to use that, I know a bit about what to press. I mean, Matching data. I mean, it would make sense that his data would be uh, all around here. I mean, he worked and slept, took a rest. Yeah. Um, alright. I have some more questions. Okay. So, tell me what you know about Leonard. He was my supervisor. I've been Do you know anything about his private life? Ah, <sighs> he was kind of a quiet guy. All right. he was strong as a horse. Fond of books, too. He liked books? What kinds? I don't know. All sorts. Maybe go check his room or something. Uh, let's use biometrics analyzer first. How does the organics processor work? No, don't make me. F hmm. So he's, can I use amnesia? Wait. I have some more. Okay. Oh wait, no. Hey, hush now. Look into my eyes. I'll make the pain go away. I, uh, wait. Who are you? I'm Special Agent Vera England. I need to ask you a few questions. Okay, I, I'm not sure how I can help, but I'll try. Man, I'm so... Okay, so now he's not panicked anymore. So he can ask about the organics processor. How does the organics processor work? The materials are sent through a grinder to be broken down and then burned to make biogas for fuel. All right. Is there any way to access something that was sent through the machine? Well, the grinding thing can be retracted by using the control panel, but it waits for the latest batch to be fully incinerated first. So, what if I need to get something out of there without it burning up? I suppose you could do that by disconnecting the incinerator. And how would I do that? I guess one way would be to cut off the power supply by unplugging the yellow cable over All there. All right, the, the yellow entrance. cable. Got Perfect. It. Thanks. Let's ask about the doll. So, tell me. He's my supervisor. Been working for him. Do you know anything about his. Oh, uh. I guess he's a bit of a quiet. He liked books? I don't know, ma'am. Alright. Well, let's ask about the murder. What can you tell me about. Wait. Oh. 
Okay, so we triggered him again. But it's fine. Gabriel? Yes, ma'am. Um no. What okay. do you know about Lin? No. Oh fuck. Okay. Roger that. Uh, let's disconnect the yellow wire then. I tried pulling it loose, but it's Ah. Muscle boost. Yellow wire. Okay. The yellow cable. Then I guess control panel. A control panel. Or looks like the hue. I have some more. Okay. I I'm special. Okay. Oh, oh fuck! There's a bug flying around. Wait, How does your the material? All right. Well, the grinding thing can be retracted by using the control panel, but it's so. I and I guess perfect. Okay. Okay. All right. <laughs> Come on, fuck off! Why is the fucking stuff flying around near me? Guess that's the intake for materials to be recycled. Uh, let's use the biometric scanner. No, biometric forensic. Well, I can't see his DNA there, actually. Which is interesting to me. Um. A control panel. Oh. I think that retracted the grinding gears. Alright, now let's check it out. There was a small key among the remains. It must have been in the victim's pocket. Ugh, this is quite a mess. I'm not equipped to deal with this. I'll have to ask Dr. Pearson to come here and gather the body parts. Okay, well, at least we got the key. Hey, Gabriel. Yeah? I've managed to secure the body. You're free to leave and get back to your other duties. The remains are in quite bad shape, so I think it's best if Dr. Pearson collects them. Roger that, ma'am. I think the doctor has some medical emergency this morning, but he should be able to take care of it today or tomorrow. Good. Tell him to bring it all to the morgue. Will do. I'll go find him right away. Uh, can I leave too? Doesn't look like this place is up and running today, so I think I'll go have a drink or something. I suppose. I'll call for you if I come up with any more questions. Okay. That was actually very successful, holy shit. Maybe I needed a bit of a break. Um, can we check out the books now to see? Mostly history books. I mean, it is his key. It's the key I found in the recycling center. Likely belonged to Leonard. Yes, is it for the desk? That action doesn't seem... No, alright. Um... All right, looks like these are the materials last put into the smelter. Oh, okay. Various tools and lots of knives headed for recycling. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Uh, blade shape. <laughs> Fuck. Wow, I think I just found the weapon that killed Carl and Maya. Hmm, no DNA or prints. So this knife must have been thoroughly cleaned. Damn, did I fuck up and I didn't do this before? Can we pick it up? Come on. Got the knife. Alright, good. It's gonna be like, come on, we should be able to pick it up. Alright, up. A few crates of... Well, I guess the only thing to do is leave then, I guess. Oh. Hi, honey. No, no. Wait, what? It wasn't a dream? I must be going crazy. The blue is messing with my head. Uh, that's 
one way to say hello. You doing okay there, darling? Not really, Alex. How can I help them? This is weird for me, too. I have no idea. It's so strange seeing you like this. Well, I'm here now. Maybe we should just try to make the best of it. I guess so. Great. So, uh, how are you doing? Really? Oh, you know, keeping it together somehow. I thought taking on this case would give me a chance to get away from everything. I get that. We went through a lot. Yeah, you can say that again. Well, I'll let you get back to the case. <sighs> Let's talk later, all right? Man, I'm so okay. fucking angry. This fucking... I must be losing my mind. It's like two millimeters, a two millimeter big bug. It's just fucking annoying me. All right, let's see. Uh, let's talk to the street artist. Let's first look at the mural. A mural depicting some kind of abstract art. Hey there. Hi. Whoa, bad ass co. Oh, thanks. Got it a week ago. Right on. You need to get some patches and stickers and shit for it too. Give it some personality. I might just do that. So, you're some kind of artist. Yeah? What do you think? Oh, I finally got it. Die, you fucking. Uh, Alright, uh. Looks like two flowers hugging. It's gotta be ball lighting, right? Uh, let's say it looks like two flowers hugging. Looks like two flowers hugging. Ha. That's an interesting take. Oh. I guess that increased my empath empathy thing. Uh, Alright. I'll leave him. Um, let's go to the northwest. So the northwest takes me here, which I've not been. And if I go oh, to Mima Road, is this okay? So it brings me here. I don't need that. And if I go east, where do I end up? To the Yonk Yard, okay. Some fairly advanced solar panels. Those alone should be capable of powering up several blocks. Jesus. Oh, but I'm thinking they probably don't use a lot of electricity right here, actually. So yeah. Not, no, I, not sure where that door leads. That combination makes... What? It makes no sense? I don't see how those... A door and a key. A light beacon, marking the north... Alright, well, let's go to the junk heap. I don't have a reason to visit the junk heap right now. Uh oh, okay. The junk piles extend some half a mile into the empty eastern part of town. I doubt they're being added to, though. Nordson residents seem conscientious about recycling. Oh, and now I'm back here. Okay. Um, do I want to visit a doctor and see what the emergency is? Leonard Dahl was somehow killed and then shredded to bits in the recycling center. Well, before I do that, I'm actually gonna visit... Uh, oh, it's the mall. Alright. Not sure what happened here, but it looks like old damage. Somebody swept up the glass on the outside, but didn't bother with actually repairing the windows. 
Uh, let's see. Doesn't look functional. There's probably. Yeah, there's a staircase right here. Uh, let's... Oh. I don't feel an urge. I think that leads to a church of some kind. Okay, so there's actually nothing to do here. So let's go to the doctor then. Oh wait. Um. That that's not the right. I'm gonna go in here. Oh, hello. This guy is not here anymore. I do want to see. Was there something in here? There's that red light again. Something must be wrong. Oh. Well, let's check. Uh, let's. Oh, we got help. What was it? Uh, chamber status. Uh, oh, the tank oh. is nearly out of nutrients. I should keep an eye out for a replacement canister. Oh, okay. Odd looking thing. Looks like something is. Probably the canister would be my guess. Okay. So we are looking for some nutrients. Not sure what those are. Lettuce, carrot. Uh, maybe go to the police station first. Talk to this guy. Hello again, Gabriel. Hey there, can I be of assistance? Yeah, did you get the bitch? I'm looking for a nutrient canister. Know where I can get my hands on one of those? No idea. But didn't Maya have some kind of machine in her apartment for that sort of thing? Oh, oh yeah, you're right. Yeah. Thank you, friend. Let's show the murder weapon. Have a look at this. It's the weapon used to kill Carl and Maya. Looks generic. We have hundreds of knives like that in town. Any prints or DNA on it? Nope. Totally clean. Damn. Hopefully it could still be helpful in some way. All right, I'm off. Good luck out there. I mean, I'm guessing they probably don't. They haven't arrested her yet then. Would be my guess, yeah, no. Go to the school first. Oh, oh yeah, or should we prioritize the the baby in the tank? I think the children grew these themselves. That's good. Gives them some practical skills. Looks disconnected. Probably not worth the energy. Mm. I don't need to rummage. Let's look at the drawings. drawings of different plants and trees. With okay. Stuff. Various books. Nothing out. Well, let's see. Do we have any Leonard's DNA in here? No. Doesn't seem like it. Okay. Empty. Guess they're Oh okay. I don't need to run Looks like a few kids left some of their So there's nothing to do here. At the moment at least. But is in the patient room? No. So yeah, I'm guessing he's probably still in the morgue, but 
Let's see if Leonard's key works on this door. Doesn't fit. No, alright. Ah, the doctor's not here. One last wait. I think that appears to be I'll wash my hands. I'll wash my hands when I go to bed. Plenty of times. Well, I mean. I suppose that's where the doc should still wash your hands. Come on. Just because you might get dirty, more dirty. Horrible how much death I read that in a <laughs> Okay, so the doctor's not in at the moment. Oh, hello. Have you fixed this? Hi there. I see that there's been some progress with the fallen power line. Yep. Feel free to head in now. Great. I'll do that later. But before I do that, let's go... ...into Maya's place and look. Doesn't appear to have power. Just as well. I wouldn't know how to make heads or tails of it. Oh, but that's not good. We, w we want to see... Let's see, does Leonard have any DNA here? Nope. Uh, Carl... Nothing as well. Not sure what kind of plants those are. Nice collect. I've looked there. Are a trophy. I have no clue what this thing does, but it looks like. Yeah. Okay. So we can't do that yet. Whatever it is. No need to go. Looks like an old house. All right, a military robot. Wow, this thing must have been fearsome back in the day. Okay, so it's laser points here. Looks like this is modeled from how the world looked pre-collapse. There's no crack caused by the hyperloop failure, and the crater field is nowhere to be seen. Okay. Path of the Pilgrim. Hmm. Kind of an odd name for an exhibition about the collapse. Uh, maybe she was part of the conduit. I mean, come on. Oh, a, a regeneration tank. pod kept people healthy and energetic. The human wave was a loose affiliation of political and religious movements with the supreme goal of eradicating AI. It is widely considered to be the largest single cause of the collapse. Post-collapse, the movement continued its activities to some extent up to 4AR, but gradually lost its ability to maintain any larger operations due to the extensive deglobalization. Over time, the subgroups of the human wave splintered back into their original factions. Some, having accomplished their goals, ceased to exist completely. Others, like the Church of Epos, Earth Preservation Orthodox Society, were formed to find a new place in a post-collapse world. Huh. The collapse occurred on what we now refer to as Year Zero AR, Anno Reducto, Year All of the right. Collapse. During this time, AI was involved intimately in every part of our lives. The typical family could not be sustained without it for more than a few weeks. A coalition of anti-technology, anti-globalist, and religious movements, referred to as the Human Wave, reached a critical mass due to a series of AI incidents across the globe. A growing fear of the singularity, mainly proposed by Voice for Human Progress, VFHP, was a contributing right. factor, 
as were proven hardware parts and widespread robotics across the globe. On June 2nd, the third decree UN resolution was passed, declaring that all AI was scheduled to be discontinued over a course of 10 years. An observant reader may notice that this definition is different from the third decree we live by today, wherein CPUs are completely outlawed. This is because the third decree has been amended 12 times. However, the phasing out period for AI did not proceed as planned, and we now enter an era in which there are large holes in our historical records. But we do know that there was a massive worldwide blackout, rendering most computer chips and processors in the world unusable. Huh. Contemporary the scholars have theorized about what exactly caused this sudden change. If it was a deliberate large-scale attack, an unintended consequence of the ongoing shutdowns, or if there could be natural causes, such as solar flares. The evidence is scarce, and the lack of global communication and infrastructure, not to mention the struggle for daily survival, has made truth-seeking in this matter extraordinarily difficult. Regardless, the end result was clear. From that day, the old world was no more. In the dark, we took our first stumbling steps as truly free humans, surrounded by our mountains of dead machines. Um, button and those. I know that there's something. It ah, shows Star various Man. star constellations. Apparently, the ones we plan to explore with some incredible new rocket engine that they were about to finish when the collapse happened. Huh. I'm pretty sure these were flown autonomously, and that some famous world leader got killed by hackers who took control of her vehicle. A terrorist group claimed responsibility, and there was a bloody civil war. Huh. All right. No idea what this is. Must have been some kind of local thing. I remember reading about some military experiment. Okay, and from. And is that all? This facility has been deemed compliant with the third decree. Well, you would expect my, uh, you would expect her DNA to be in here, but nothing. Huh. Okay. That is strange. Oh, wait. Can I use the knife on these things? That action doesn't seem... That combination... I don't see how... That action... Come on. That combination... Not sure... I have no... I have no clue. Can I do use amnesia on myself? No. I don't think... I don't think extra strength... Doesn't appear to have power. So I need to get power here. Uh, let's ask her. Oh, come on, what up? There we go. Nice little garden. Uh, let's see. Power box. Looks like she's trying to fix something in this power box. This Everything under what? control? Just a normal day of fixing one. Everything under... Just a normal day. That's evidence. I shouldn't show it to just anyone. <laughs> okay, like, we shouldn't kill her? That action doesn't... Okay. else to say to him. I don't have no no new patrons looks like it's I don't I don't I think they don't.
And there's no one here. Looks a bit over. Huh. So I do wonder what I can do. I found uh, probably his key then. Unless the killer dropped it in there. In any case, I don't know what it opens. Hello. I had a few questions. By all means. I'm looking for a nutrient canister. Nowhere can get my hands on one of those. A nutrient what? Never mind. Okay. I learned that Leonard's death wasn't an accident. He was placed in that machine after his death. I suspected as much. Any leads on his killer? Some. I found the weapon that killed Carl and Maya in the recycling center, but it's clean. Hmm. So the murderer must have stashed it there after disposing of Leonard. Probably. It was placed in the metal recycler, so maybe the killer meant for it to get smelted down and destroyed. Sounds like a plausible theory. Uh, probably the truth, I mean. I have no reason to... <laughs> Do you know who Katarina Berg is, the school teacher? She also calls herself Melinda. Sorry, I'm bad with names. Hmm. Did you know Leonard? Not at all. I don't need to make him for. <laughs> okay. This weapon killed Carl. And all three killings must be connected. Great. Any idea of what this opens? Nope. Hello. A safe. That's Parrot. all I needed. Very well. Well, let's see if we can find out where Leonard lives. I don't think I need to look him up. Oh, okay. I don't think I... I don't need to look... I don't need to... So nothing, alright. Looks like a logbook. Maybe Anderson records his... Huh? <sighs> I've looked there. Maybe later. Doesn't appear. So I wonder what am I missing? Because that I means that place doesn't have power yet. Looks like an apartment. Now let's see if we're going to the robot shop. Hi there, Walter. Morning, miss. Oh, yeah, have a nice night's sleep. All right. I sure didn't. This numb not forgot to unplug me, so I had to listen to his snoring for nine hours. I protest, Nissa. I hardly ever sleep for more than seven. Oh, well, that makes it much less like torture. <laughs> I slept okay. The bed was a bit too soft for my taste, but I'll live. Glad to hear it. So, what can I do for you today? Um... I'm off. Stay care. Bye-bye, pal- Yeah, I'm actually going to save and quit right here. Yes, because I'm tired. And I think saving right there, the fact that it automatically God is talking probably tells me that he has something to say about either the key would be my guess or a canister uh, but yeah thank you guys for watching and I'm going to sleep